Welcome to Downey Live. If you're new to this channel, I'm Michael, and this channel showcases all the incredible people, places, and things, mostly technology, that make our world amazing. So today, I'm gonna to take you through a day in the life of a YouTuber or vlogger. Some people like to edit in the morning, some people like to edit at night, some people are always traveling. Obviously, I can only speak about my day, and today seemed interesting enough, but still accurate enough. So we're off now, go meet with my friend Riley. Morning. So, to give you some context, new year, new you, new Downey Live type thing, I wanna throw in an intro at the beginning of every video so you guys know this is a Downey Live video. So I actually made one with this song that I kinda liked and Riley was like, no, that's horrible, let me make you some music. I was like, great. So here we are, so I've sent him the intro that I had already done, which you guys saw in my last video, and he's now adapting music to that still using the imaging and everything. Okay, so the first process, the first step is we gotta watch the film and then we gotta find out where Mike put his cuts and whether or not we want to sync the music up with the cuts. <laughs> Which is super cool, but I think we can do better. Second step is now we're just gonna start throwing ideas onto the our blank canvas, so to speak. And what we like, we keep, but we don't like, we get rid of, and we kind of build from there. I'm not a fan of that. Let's get rid of it. Oh, cool. But you like it, eh? Yeah. But I really feel like I should have no say in this because I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> but I agree. I appreciate the process. That's, I almost. That's why I said don't make any comments at the very beginning. But... Okay. I think I can bury that. That's a good lead in. Yeah, right? Drops into the intro. So you want that even before your intro? Yeah. And then your picture? Yeah. Okay, now we're gonna let Riley do his work and uh, I'm gonna throw some B-roll up here for us. Oh, that's a good sound. One day we'll be so big that I can hire Riley to just score all our videos. That'd be nice. That'd be really nice. I asked for that. I, <laughs> I said I really like the Batman movies, like the Dark Knight, where it has that. <clears throat> can you play it one more time? Yeah. <clears throat> Gotta have that sound. I'm mostly a nuisance here. Riley's <laughs> used to working alone, but uh, what's the update? I think it's five out of five. Um, he'll never find a better music from anyone else. <laughs> <laughs> I have to agree. Okay, you guys haven't heard it fully done yet, so uh, let's cue up the intro. <laughs> Riley Koenig, everybody! That's how it's done. I love that. Okay. Now every every intro you see, this is the guy. This is this was the session. That was it. What did that take? An hour and a half? Would have taken me ages and it would have been so <laughs> much worse. Thanks, buddy. I've been you on a microphone. <laughs> <laughs> Up to the camera here. I'm thinking, uh, should we get you doing some sort of vocal? Doing a effect? vocal on that? I think I think we'll pass on the vocals. Thanks, man. On to the next. We're headed to the airport. So you're probably wondering why we're at the airport. Today we're not traveling. We're here to pick up the world famous Will Edmund, everybody! Oh, hey, Will! What's up? Oh, <laughs> Welcome to Canada! Seat. Thanks, man. First oh, the time. weather is so nice. It's not so bad. Oh, it's not bad. I think I'm moving. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome. Well, come on around. Let's bro. get your bags in. Hey, hey, hey! hey. <laughs> First thoughts of Vancouver? Yes, man. I'm about, bro, the flight wasn't too long. Then we can come back yeah. and hang out with you some more. <laughs> Where was your stopover? Uh, Salt Lake City. Salt Lake. Salt Lake. Yeah. Wow. So you wait. You came from Atlanta. Atlanta. Atlanta to Salt Lake to Vancouver. Lake That's three City. Olympic host cities. Oh, that is true. Because like, Salt Lake in had one the, day. Um, the Winter Olympics. Yeah. Atlanta had 1996. And Olympics. Vancouver had Olympics. 2010 Vancouver winter. Had 2010. Yep. Three Olympic host cities. In, in one day. History. Hey. I love it. That's hey. why Mike has a great channel. Like, 
You're already subscribed to him. <laughs> <while you're watching. laughs> okay, full disclosure. The rest of the afternoon was filled with a meeting, going to the gym, going grocery shopping, and then to bed. So I actually didn't bring my camera along for those things. I didn't bring you with me. So I'm gonna do today. Today's another day. Today's the next day. Today's tomorrow. T today's today. We're gonna. I'm gonna bring you with me today again. So we're, it's the morning. We're uh, we're with Will, showing him around Vancouver. And we're currently in the Dr. Sun Yat-sen Japanese Garden. More than just a thrill, not just in it for the thrill. So if you watched my Las Vegas series, you saw Will. I read all the comments on my videos and I know Will does because I, I, I was well. <laughs> watching his videos in Mexico and left a comment, you know, something along the lines of like, Will, I love your energy. I think you and I would collaborate really well together. Sure. So he went over and checked out my channel and was like, Mike, let's do this. Let's and do uh, so we met in Las Vegas and now it's seven months later and we're mm -hmm. together again. In my hometown, so I get to show him around. Thanks, Mike. Next, we're gonna have to go to so Texas. Beautiful. Let's do it. Okay, you ready well, for it? It's a country. We'll finish with today first. <laughs> <laughs> what, what video are we filming for you today? Top three things to do in Vancouver, Canada. So as the local guide, I'm showing him around and I, you let me know if this is worth seeing, but I brought him to the world's skinniest building. As you can see, it's only six feet wide. So while we're out wandering around Vancouver working on Will's video, it's really just an opportunity for me to have some fun, make a montage for you guys. Let's, let's get to the montage right now. So one of my favorite parts about showing friends around the city is getting them to take getting to take them to some of my favorite spots like Japa Dog. So you have nori on your hot dog, Japanese mayo, teriyaki sauce, I have fried cabbage and some Japanese fried rolls, all on a hot dog. That Japa dog was delicious, man. I could've ate two of those. Maybe we will. Maybe we'll go back. <laughs> man, I can go back right there. I really could. It's not over yet. We're not done filming Will's video, so uh, out we go again. We have 15 minutes to get to where we need to be or we miss it completely. Will, can we make it? I think we can. He has no idea. He's never been there, he has no idea how far away. But I like his positivity. I think we can make it too. So the last stop on Will's video is one of my favorite spots I had to show him is the nine o'clock gun here in Stanley Park with an awesome view of Vancouver behind us. But best of all, check this out. So I wouldn't say that today or yesterday was particularly average day, but to be honest, no day as a vlogger is an average day. It's very different, but it almost always does involve collaborations in some way, whether I'm partnering with a company, working with Riley to make my intro music this morning, working with Will as he flew in and surprised me, or, or anyone. I don't know where I'm going next, but I know I want you there with me. See you next time. And now I have to upload all the footage, edit the photos. If I'm honest, I'm not gonna get to edit the video tonight, but gotta back it all up.